Okay, so we'll take you through the wooden door into the bedroom, and then, oh la la, will you look at that? ...in the distance, we'll show you on the balcony after, we'll start here in the bedroom. ...leading into a bathroom area, so just here in the, before we, so just as soon as we step foot inside the bathroom, we're greeted by a nice beautiful bathtub there, and then, oh la la, will you look at that for a view, swimming pool down below, and then the ocean in the distance. Look at the ceilings, so, so beautiful. Here's the other side of the swimming pool now, just to give you another angle. The sun push this back here like this. And then there we are, we're out onto Parang Beach. So this is a sushi. Take you around and show you inside. So just we step foot inside, we have a we'll take you and give you a look at the price menu. We're outside here at Spa Karuna. Hello, good afternoon girls. That's just in the back there. So here's the coffee kiosk, the best coffee in Sonor is 25,000. Okay. So just at the back we have an artificial grass area, some nice tables and chairs, some beautiful seating here out the back. Good afternoon from Bali, Indonesia. So today I'm here in Sonor, I'm on a street called Jalampantai Karang, which is just off the main street of Jalandana Tambalingan, which runs through central Sonor. And what I'm going to feature in today's video for you is an accommodation called Villa Pantai Karang. So for those of you that are looking for an accommodation right here on the beach in Sonor, then maybe today's video is going to be of interest for you. So to, in today's video, I'm going to feature an accommodation called Villa Pantai Karang. Now there's some fabulous room types available at this accommodation. It has an absolutely fabulous location on Jalan Pantai Karang. You're located right on the beach staying at this accommodation. Pantai Karang um, adjoins the main street of Jalandana Tambalingan, which runs through central Sonor, which is home to a great collection of uh, restaurant, warung and shopping options. Also Artisan down the supermarket is not too far away, making this a fabulous choice for your hotel accommodation here in Sonor, Bali. So what I'm going to start off by doing is I'm going to take you inside Villa Pantai Karang, I'm going to give you a room and facility tour. We're just going to step outside of the back of Villa Pantai Karang onto Karang Beach and show you the beach location. And then after I've finished inside the accommodation, I'm going to head up um, Jalan Pantai Karang to the main street of Jalan Dana Tambalingan and show you what restaurant, warung and shopping options are available on the street there. So without any further ado, let's go and get started and share with you Villa Pantai Karang. Okay, so this is the main entrance here to Villa Pantai Karang. So just if we turn right, coming out of Villa Pantai Karang, that's going to be heading up to the main street of Jalandana Tambalingan. If we turn left, coming out of Pant Villa Pantai Karang, that's going to be heading to Karang Beach. We'll take you around and show you inside. So here's the name up above there. There's the number. And we'll take you along this driveway. Really nice, impressive driveway. And then just as we get to this section here, the car, the um, this opens out for car parking for cars. Have a security desk on the right hand side there. And then we just continue walking through now to the um, villas and the swimming pool area. And then just to the left there, we have a parking area for motorbikes. Have a sink here if you want to wash your hands, and then now we're going to take the track leading to the um, villas. Beautiful checkered pathway leading down here. So just on either side now, on the right here, this is the start of the um, garden villa accommodation properties. So we have one doorway entrance there into one of them. have one, one doorway entrance here into another one. There's into the gardens and it's up there in the back. Some it's occupied so we can't take you in there. And we have an impressive temple there in the centre. And then now we're into the gardens. We've got ponds either side here. And a pond on this side pond on this side and then directly in the middle we have the swimming pool area okay so we're just going we're going to walk past the swimming pool for now we'll take you and bring you back to that at the end just have a shallow pool here also to the side 
as you use pool towels basket and then just in the, around here now and to the left is a main reception desk area so here's a main reception desk area in the back there okay so this is an ocean view room here at Villa Pantai Karang this is room 101 this is 100 next door that is actually a connecting room that's a pool view room this is a um, ocean view room that we're going to feature now so we have lights either side of the doorway it's 101 it's a wooden door let's take you around and show you inside okay so it's a key to open the door here and then just as we step foot inside we have a small corridor area here with some furniture some paintings on the wall, standing lamp, that's the connecting room suitable if you're travelling with um, family and friends to the um, pool view room. Some cabinet space underneath maybe for your suitcases there and then we're going to take you up the stairway to the bedroom. So we have a small balcony here to the left with a nice um, display cabinet on there and then just here we have a bedroom. Okay, so we'll take you through the wooden door into the bedroom and then, oh la la, will you look at that. I've opened the blinds, they are roll down blinds so you can block out all the sunlight. However, I've opened them because it's a really special view there. The ocean's in the distance. We'll show you on the balcony after. We'll start here in the bedroom. So just opposite us, we have a four poster um, king or queen size bed, uh, mosquito net wrapped around the bed nice seating area here at the base of the bed just all around we have windows with blinds all around our air conditioning is up in the top corner there so a nice seating area here so here's a bedside table on this side of the bed bed beautiful uh, decorative bedside lamp absolutely fabulous bedding immaculately clean It's a bedside table on the opposite side of the bed. There's our other bedside lamp. Another look at close up on the bed. Very impressive bed, this one. And then just at the end of the bed now and turning around. So there's all our um, blinds down, roller blinds with the windows behind. And then just here we have a soft cushion two-seater sofa. Just in the corner there we have a, a standing lamp. So beautiful big doors with plenty of light in here. You can roll the blinds down if you want to block the sunlight out. And then just over on the side there, we have a desk area. Flat screen TV also. It's a smart TV, international channels and YouTube available on the TV. Wi-Fi also provided. Just down to the side there, we have a waste bin. Just here we have a, a wooden desk, wooden chair. Beautiful decorative mirror, phone on the desk there, multi-socket PowerPoint, information brochure, Netflix on the TV remote, sharp flat screen TV. Just in the base here we have a mini refrigerator. Okay, I'm going to leave the balcony to last because it's a beautiful view and we're going to take you through into the bathroom. So just on the side here we have another window with a blind, roller blind that comes down. Have some picture painting decoration on the wall here wooden door leading into a bathroom area so just here in the before we get foot in, step foot in the bathroom we have a dressing table area wooden chair a wooden desk two drawers in the desk beautiful decorative mirror in the back there we'll start from left to right we have a tissue box two huge bottles of aqua two glasses have a kettle there two cups tea coffee sugar in the back multi-socket powerpoint nice decorative lamp and then just to the side of a desk we have a wardrobe double wardrobe area and also some open shelving so the open shelves there have a hairdryer on the shelf there cabinets in the base and then two um, doors with mirrors on for dress for dressing mirrors and then just opening a wardrobe, we have a metal rail, some wooden hangers, laptop style safety deposit box in the base there. Just down below there we have some slippers, some drawers in the base. 
So I double wardrobes to the left and then next we walk into the bathroom. I've opened all the roller blinds. There is roller blinds that roll down on all the windows if you want to block the sun out. So just as soon as we step foot inside the bathroom, we're greeted by a nice beautiful bathtub there. Um, handheld shower also on the bathtub. Some beautiful decoration above the bathtub. Solid wooden shelf. There's a close up on a hand shower. Some shampoo and hand wash or body wash on the side there. Just over in the far corner there we have a laundry basket and then just turning around here we have two wash basins, cabinets underneath just for decoration, two beautiful wooden uh, mirrors, we start from right to left so we have some towels on the um, cabinet here, nice tissue box, immaculately clean wash basin, close up on a beautiful wooden um, mirror we have a light in the middle however it isn't switched on the light switch is in the middle there and then just down below we have some hand, um, hand wash um, a container with some air, air, air cleaners and shower caps some towels some other wash basin towel on this side another tissue box on this side give you another angle on your sit your, wa your wash basins Okay, and then just on this side, we have a glass door that leads into our toilet. So we have a waste bin in the base there. Just in the back here, we have a toilet also with bum wash. And just coming out of a shower, there's a window. View outside, views into the beautiful tropical gardens there. And then just over in the side here, we have another glass door with a towel rail on the door. And then this is a walk-in shower cubicle. Up above, we have an overhead rain shower, handheld shower, some soap, shampoo, conditioner on the wall there, immaculately clean in the base. Ooh la la, wow. Okay, so just a look at your uh, bathroom with your blinds rolled down so you can see it blocks out all the light. Okay, so this is a pool view, pool view room here at Villa Pantai Kerrang. This is room 200. Just next door is room 201. That's actually an ocean view, view room. However, it does connect with this. We'll show you the connecting door inside. So we have lights outside. There's the number on the wall there, 200. Just before we step in through the door, they provide umbrellas just in case it rains here in Bali. And then just now we'll take you through the wooden door and into the bedroom. Okay, so just as we step foot inside the room, we're greeted by a queen size bed. We have a bedside table on the left hand side with a bedside lamp, some picture painting decoration up above. We have a, um, a roll roller blind there and a window, air conditioning up above there. This is a connecting room to a um, ocean view room. Just there we also have another um, window with a roll down blind. Just in the um, corner there we have a desk, wooden desk, wooden chair, LG flat screen TV, telephone, multi socket PowerPoint, information brochure. Just opposite there we have a big balcony leading out um, to the swimming pool area. As the door that we entered the room, we have a rug on the floor, soft cushion seating sofa, another window with a roller blind behind the sofa, and then there's a sofa down below, just in the corner there, standing lamp, and then we'll just take you out here quickly and show you this. So we have a sliding door, just on the balcony, two wooden chairs, wooden coffee table, wooden clothes rack rail to the side there, and then just here we have a pond outside. Okay, so now we're going to take you through this wooden lockable door into the bathroom. So we have a lock on the door and just inside here we have a dressing table area, waste bin in the base there, wooden um, dressing table, kettle, tea, coffee, sugar, cups, two bottles of aqua, PowerPoint in the back there, tissue box, nice decorative mirror there on the wall, have a cabinet on this side mini refrigerator inside the cabinet. There's nothing else in any of the cabinets there. I've already checked. And then just to the side here, we have a double wardrobe, some open shelving, provided with a hairdryer. Mirrors on the um, wardrobe. 
It's inside the wardrobe, up above a shelf, metal rail, two robes provided, collection of wooden coat hangers, safety deposit box, and then just in the base there we have some slippers and some drawers. Okay, so just from a double wardrobe now, we take you through into a bathtub. So directly ahead of us, we have a beautiful, nice uh, uh, bathtub there. Just over to the side, we have twin sinks, twin mirrors, some cabinets in the base there. Just give you a quick brush over these. Ooh la la. Power point on the wall there. Immaculately clean uh, wash basin, some towels, tissue box, another angle wrangle on a uh, bathtub and just above the bathtub we have a, a handheld shower some hand soap and shampoo towels picture decoration on the wall okay so just from the um, pool view room what we've shown you we're just going to show you next door this is the connecting room this is room 201 this is a pool view room so it's the same as the room that we've featured already Small little balcony area here. And then there's the room inside. Let me just take you through, it's exactly the same as the room that we've already featured. Dressing table area, cabinet to the side there, and then there's a bathroom. So here's a view through your window and the ocean's in the distance, however it's a bit um, secluded by the trees. So just from a main reception desk area now, we'll take you and show you the rest of the facility. So just to the left there, that's the pool um, uh, view room that we've just featured. And then just on the right hand side here, we have a um, guest um, dining lounging area. Nice big wooden table here. Curtains all around, beautiful light fittings, beautiful rooftop here. And then just in the back here, we have a beautiful, comfortable looking seating area. Ooh la la, will you look at that? Nice big table in the middle there. And then just from this area here, now we're going to take you into the swimming pool area. So just here, we have a um, like bathing, shallow swimming pool area. There's the um, pond at the back there, just opposite the room we featured in the video. Beautiful gardens, nice areas here to the side. Some stone statues here. Ooh la la. And then there's a swimming pool area. Okay, so just in the swimming pool here, we have like steps down and seating areas in the pool. We have some sun lounges at the back here. These are the same as what you could see on the other side of the pool. Wooden sun lounges, soft cushion tops. Just here we have a seating area here in the pool also. And then just on the opposite side of the pool here we have another shallow pool area. Another step seating area in the pool here. And then there's another angle on your pool. Here's the other side of the swimming pool now, just to give you another angle. The sun lounge is on this side also. Okay, so back on the other side of the swimming pool now, and then there's a mini swimming pool. And then just in the back here, we have this beautiful area here. This is like a lounging dining area again, or lounging area, this one really, not dining. Nice collection of um, comfortable seating areas in here. Some nice decorative furniture also. Big um, seating area there. Also some here. Look at the ceilings, so, so beautiful. And then just in the back here, we have this really, really beautiful seating area or relaxing area. Okay, we're now at the rear end of the swimming pool. We're gonna take you out to the beach area here. So just at the back of the swimming pool area here, this is going to be the gateway leading out onto the beach. So we just push this back here like this. And then there we are, we're out onto Parang Beach. 
So just on the beach here we have a nice collection of wooden sun lounges, soft cushion seating. Seating area over to the side there. Okay, so now I've finished my room and facility tour here at Villa Pantai Karang. I'm going to head out onto the street of Jalandana Tambalingan and show you the restaurant where rung and shop options available. Okay, so as soon as we've stepped foot outside of uh, Villa Pantai Karang, we're going to turn right, making our way towards Jalandana Tambalingan. Even though Villa Pantai Karang has got its own beach location, this would be the normal access route, for, access route for everybody else coming down to the Karang beach. So we're going to turn right and make our way up the street. Okay, so just on the left hand side here, this is um, Villa uh, Wantalim, uh, Wantalim Puti. Is also connected with um, Villa um, Pantai Karang. We're just going to continue walking up the street. Okay, so we're coming to the end of um, Pantai Karang now. Um, this is the main street of Jalandana Tambalingan. This way he's going to be heading down towards the Sindhu area of Sonor. Many restaurants in this area. And then this way he's going to be heading towards um, Artisan Dana Supermarket Central Sonor area. So just across the street there we have Bamboo Blonde which is a ladies clothing shop, we have Forchetto Italian restaurant and then we'll start here just on the corner we have a place called Billy's Cafe, or Billy's Cafe and Restaurant, we'll just take you in through the main entrance, coffee and cake and here's the main entrance to Billy's Cafe. Nice collection of tables and chairs here, wooden tables and chairs. All around and in the back there. And then just by the roadside here we have a really nice seating area also. Okay, so just across the street from Caf Small Gas, uh, from Billy's Caf now, we have a place called Forchetta. This is the outside seating area. We also have a Galato factory selling some delicious ice cream here at Forchetta. Oh la la, will you look at those? They look delicious. Many beautiful looking ice creams available in there. And then now we'll take you around and show you inside the restaurant. So just inside the restaurant, have a nice um, seating area inside here. Beautiful light decoration. Just to the side here we have a bar counter area and then ooh la la look at that light in the middle nice tables and chairs and we'll just take you directly through to the back this is a nice area at the back here so just at the back we have an artificial grass area some nice tables and chairs some beautiful seating here out the back this motorbike in the back here also and oh la la, fabulous. Okay, so just across the street from Forchetta, we have a place called Caf Small Gas. This is quite a popular place here, just by the um, German consulate down Pantai Karang. Let's take you around and show you inside. So we have a nice seating area on the right hand side in that area also and then this is the main seating area leading inside to the calf. Nice collection of wooden tables and chairs here, beautiful seating here also. And then just inside the doorway there's the inside the calf, beautiful decoration on the wall, nice collection of tables and chairs. Okay, so just across from Caf Small Gas now, we have a place called Lola's Craft Beer House. Just show you some of the beers available here. La la. Nice seating area here. And then just inside here is the bar area. Okay, so Lola's Craft Beer is just in the distance there, the green sign just by the yellow sign and then I'm just across the street now 
Here we're at a place called Bald Electric Bikes, great place if you want to rent your bikes. Nori Bali Sushi and Asian Kitchen. And then just in the corner there, we have a Billabong stop shop. Okay, so just we'll start at Bald Electric Bikes. So just here, this is a great place if you want to rent bikes. These are the premium bikes here in Sonor, available for rental. And then just next door to Bald Electric Bikes, we have Nori Bali. Nice seating area here outside. Seating to the side also. So this is a sushi. Take you around and show you inside. So just we step foot inside, we have a nice collection of seating, some beautiful picture painting decoration on the wall, a counter area in the back, and then another beautiful collection of seating on the opposite side. Okay, so just from Nori Bali Sushi Kitchen, we have a place across the road called Sumo Restro and Cellar. I'll just take you across the street and show you inside. So here's the inside the restaurant, nice collection of tables and chairs in here. A bar counter area is there at the back. And then just to the side here, we have some beautiful um, Balinese statues and a nice artificial grass area with a water fountain in the back there. Okay, so just back across the street from Sumo Restro and Cellar now, we have Spicy Tattoo Studio next door. We have um, Warung Rainbow, which is a little Warung right next door to the tattoo studio there. Collection of tourist goods shops on the opposite side of the street also. And then just back on this side of the street, we have one of the popular spas here in Sonor, Koa Boutique Spa. So there's the name on the sign there. We'll take you and give you a look at the price menu. So there's all the tourist goods shops, the collection across the street there, the Little Warung, the Tattoo Studio, Nuri um, Sushi, and then just here we have a place called I Undersell. So this is a place if you need your um, SIM cards, and well, we'll show you on the board what they sell. So this is what's available here at I Undersell. It's just in the back there, there's also a tourist booking service as well. So just next door to I Undersell, we have a place called Blink by Capo Lewut. This is a very popular jewellery shop, multiple branches here in Bali, beautiful jewellery this. So just next door to Blink by Capo Lewut, we have a place called White Jasmine Body Massage. So this is a place for your massage and all your spa treatments. Okay, so just across the street from Blink by Capital Up, the jewellery shop, White Jasmine Body Massage there also. Just on this side we have a brand new place, this is a place called Mason Matter. This is a place to get your sunglasses from. And then just next door to Mason Matter we have a place called Burrito Leather Custom, uh, Custom Leather. This is a leather goods shop here, many leather items for sale. satchel there also on the bike so just from burrito custom leather just on the opposite side of the street there we have a circle k convenience store just here we have um, a place for your bag of your car and motorbike rental many motorbikes for rent there in the back also a tour booking service and then just on the opposite side of the road we have a place called Unwind Mind and Body. This is a spa place and then Bali Top Optical. Okay so just turning back on this side of the street here now we have a place called a lit art shop. Beautiful collection of wood carvings available in here. Many beautiful wood carvings all the way into the back there. Also has some placemats for the home, many bowls, carvings, etc. All available in the back there. Also has some um, hand soap as well. 
Okay, so we've got burrito leather, a motorbike rental, a wood carving shop, and then just next in line, we have a place called Spa Karuna. Just check you up close. All the girls are outside here at Spa Karuna. Hello, good afternoon, girls. That's just in the back there. They're saying massage, yeah. And then we'll just give you a look at the prices here also. There's all the prices here at Karuna some packages available also so there's Spa, Spa Karuna just across the street there just next door to Spa Karuna we have Guardian Pharmacy in case you get a headache and then just next door to Guardian Pharm Pharmacy we have a place called Copy Kiosk okay so I've just crossed the street now to Copy Kiosk Coffee Hut Nice little simple place this for your coffee, nice seating area here by the roadside. There's a counter area in the back there. And then just to the side we also have another simple seating area. And then this place also has an inside seating area if you want to sit away from the noise of the road etc. Here's the inside of the coffee shop. Very unique setting in here. Beautiful light fittings up above there. Nice decoration on the wall. And then just through the back here we have a nice comfort seating area. There's the inside. So here's the coffee kiosk. The best coffee in Sonor is 25,000. Okay, so just from coffee kiosk now we're going to turn back to the opposite side of the street. Just in the corner here we have a place called Betty Bake, however it's closed, so that's like a bakery. We have Art Shop Agung next door, Ginger Snap Barley which is a clothing shop, we'll show you in a moment. Copy Toco which is a coffee shop and then just next door to Copy Toco we have Capol the Wook which is another jewellery shop. So we've just cut across the street now, we almost got run over, we'll start at Ginger Snap. There's a name on the door. It's a nice impressive range of clothing here for, lady, uh, for men and ladies. Some more here. And then just next door, here's Copy Toco. So here's some of what's available here at Copy Toco. Some protein shakes. Nice outside seating area here. take you in through the door so just as we step foot inside straight ahead there's a counter area have a beautiful decoration on the wall and then some really nice simple seating available also so here's copy toco there's the capital Luat jewelry and then just next in line we have a place called wabi sabi Blanc du Nil, Hills Tribe Jewellery and Filthy Gorgeous, which is another jewellery shop all across the street there. So we cut across the street now to Wabasabi, just to show you what's available here. So this is like a make your own stuff here. Choose all your own different things there. Not sure whether you can see it on the camera, maybe better with the picture. It's all there. The beautiful seating area here by the roadside. Nice decoration on the walls, beautiful lighting. Some more seating there to the side also. And then we'll take you around and show you inside. So just turning to the right, first of all, we have another beautiful collection of seating there. Some beautiful lighting. Counter areas there at the back in the middle. And then just to the side we have another beautiful collection of seating. Okay, so just coming out of Wabi Sabi now, next door, this is Blanc de Nil that we showed you across the street. We'll just give you a close-up on some of the clothing. It's got ladies and men's clothing. This looks like a whole white collection. Nice big collection inside the shop there, all 299. And then here's some of the designs here also. There's the price. Okay, so from Wabi Sabi, Blanc de Nil, and then we've got Hills Tribe Jewellery, Filthy Gorgeous Jewellery, and then just behind me here in the background, this is Artisendana Supermarket. So we're going to go around the side here first of all. 
This is a Galato Secrets natural ice cream, however it's closed now. We have some ATM machines on the side here if you need to use an ATM, many different banks available there. Have parking for cars here, parking for motorbikes in the middle. And then just at the main entrance here, this is a Purpleless bookstore here inside Artisendana Supermarket. And then just uh, this is the main entrance to Artisendana Supermarket. <laughs> and then ju just, just to the side here, we also have a um, small restaurant, Warung area.